If you are looking to get better at Warzone, then this is the video for you. I'm going to be diving deep into my mind and how I play Warzone. That way you can learn to become a professional player or at least be a little bit better. If you find this video informative, please subscribe to the channel and join the Discord. That way you can find some friends and get some wins. Discord.gg slash expel. So I'm going to be hopping in and I'm going to be trying to go through my mind as I play. I've got a guy trying to tickle my AA. And in here, stop here grab this no one came down so we're pretty much good there but i'd say we're gonna find a guy down here somewhere so what i'm gonna do is switch out that that's a recon usually people yep yeah, yep yeah, yeah. why why did it seems a little laggy so Immediately when I drop down here, I assume that whatever side you came in from, there's going to be people there, right? And my reasoning for that is that people like to try and be first. They try to be first where wherever they go. So uh, I try to not. Because I don't really care. I don't think it matters as long as you land on a gun, you know? Because most people, when you land down there on those sides, they end up having to, like, loot for, like, 20 minutes. I swear, dude. Team is hunting you. Don't become prey. So it's just not worth it. Right there, what I was doing is I knew that I had a speed boost, so I was going back and forth right here, making him think that he was going to have an opportunity to get the elimination, but it just wasn't going to happen because I had, like, better positioning and stuff like that. And he was also just for some reason thinking that I couldn't shoot him through that grate. Which, as long as you have a Vanguard or a Black Ops Cold War gun, a lot of times they have, like, a little bit more penetration than your Modern Warfare guns, you know? So this guy right here is sitting in the window. So what I'm going to do is ADS, stand up, pop him in the face. Immediately took care of business. He's gone. I also had the bounty get averted at the exact same time, even though it's not this guy, which is kind of funny. So I'm going to go ahead and hit this. It just makes people not want to come down here anymore is my thing. Get a free UAV out of it. Looks like the guy was over there. I don't know if that guy there's a guy right over there as well so what i'm doing right now is like i'm trying to utilize my uh wait is he just in this guy tell me he's not in this guy no he's not So I shot that guy one time, which means I can just basically push up with my SMG, pop him a few times, and he should be done. And right now I'm thinking about positioning because half the map is already out and my freaking keyboard stopped working for a second, which is ideal. What is happening? Lord have mercy. Thank God for combat scout right there because I was trying to utilize the rock as cover, but the problem was that every single time I peeked up because that guy was on controller, he was able to shoot me because when you're on controller and you get stunned, your aim's basically better. Nice. We've got another guy shooting from up top, so I'm going to focus up on that. I saw that car on the radar. That guy's going to push over to that guy to pick up his loot, guaranteed. Doesn't matter. I'm going to go ahead and rotate. Oh, no, no, no. He was up top. I thought he was down here, but he's not. So when I go up this way, I need to think about the cover that I'm going to be using as I push up, okay? We have that guy right there, but that's not who we're focused on. We're focused on this guy, who's now dead. This guy's landing in. Missed the shots. He's cracked. And he gave us a free kill. 
And we have another guy in the sky who seems to be over here. So don't see it. Don't see it. Looking around. We still have this guy's body right here for loot. Because that guy never pushed up. And what I'm doing right now is I'm just watching my backside. This is something I talk about a lot in my spectating videos. If you're a smart player, instead of doing Iceman Isaac's pinwheel rotation. Oh, that guy has a gun. Yeah, thanks. You'll start to uh, you'll start to watch your backside instead. Engaging shooter. You going for the car? And because of that, people are gonna try to like come in and whatnot because they're so used to thinking that they need to do this pinwheel rotation that they were told to do so long ago. But, but they haven't adapted, right? So you can just constantly watch your backside. He's gonna go for that car. New safe zone highlighted. What? The? And then slowly watch people just come in as like free kills. That's uh, free kill for someone else. Oh, it's a free kill for me. I didn't get the kill. So that guy's probably going to peek up on that rock. Because he knows he has the positional advantage so what i'm gonna do instead of trying to ego challenge for these kills we're gonna just rotate around because if i'm that guy i'm ta i'm taking like high ground and going for it you know so i'm gonna take this and i'm gonna launch straight you see him right there dang son so as i go up here i'm checking i don't see anything oh i do see something There's a guy right there. What? Oh, okay, sure. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to rotate around this side here. I saw that guy when I was coming down, but we should have people over here. Nope! Didn't really do what I wanted it to, but it is okay. I don't see anyone down here, so... Oh, hold on. I might have just gotten me kill. I thought that I had the shot, but I really didn't. And I only have one extra play here. Luckily, homie was lost. What was that? So immediately, my first thought is to go there, but it's probably going to spawn me over here. Oh, perfect. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to launch or we're going to go straight down to this right here, which is inside. Are you kidding me? I literally bounced off the top. Oh. Okay. Let me explain the repeat right there. Because most people wouldn't have re-peaked that. And the reason that I chose to is because that guy seemed like he just kept going to the exact same spot. When you have someone that's going to go to the same spot over and over with no care in the world, you can expect that they're probably going to reload in that spot as well, which is exactly what that guy did. So really, you make them think that you're going to come back, but you don't give them an idea as to the timing of which you will come back. And it'll help out. Cappy, we do have a, a pinned comment telling you why I left Twitch, by the way. So what I'm going to do is just grab all of this and we're going to go up top here. God dang it. Okay. So I don't think we're going to be able to go up top right here, sadly. Which means we can't get that, which means we can't get our loadout. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and find a different way up. I heard a guy. If you're not understanding why... 
I heard a guy up above me just jumping around and dropping and skipping and hopping. And pushing that with ground loot weapons, knowing that he could have his like loadout weapons just doesn't really make sense. So I don't want to push that because it'll put me in a bad situation. And I still have a munitions box. Okay, so as I push over here, yes, I am out in the open, but I'm going in the fastest possible way that I can make happen. So I'm going to go ahead and pop my UAV. We have enough for another one, but we don't want to get caught off guard. And I'm assuming if there's a guy sitting in one of these buildings, they're going to be sitting completely still, which means Ghost is not going to actually work for them. We are going to get a selfie and a UAV. I'm going to grab the Muni. We still have this guy down here. I'm going to grab that sniper back because Solos is one of the game modes that you need a sniper and an SMG. You don't always need an assault rifle. Assault rifles are great, but you just don't always need them. Does that make sense? So knowing that the circle just moved this direction, this guy over here that we were stuck... I just got really lucky that I had that right there. Okay, let me walk you through that. Whenever I got shot, I had to think in the middle of the gunfight where cover was. Cover was right there, right? You could see it. So I went ahead and I like slid, popped a stun on the ground beside the guy and just tried to wait until he got hit with it. And then I crossed away from his line of sight because if you're on controller, it's basically aimbot if you get stunned and the guy crosses your line of sight with you ADS. So you want to make sure that if like you don't put yourself in a situation where someone can just mess you up like that. That was stupid. That was also stupid. That was a hit. Probably could have killed that guy if I would have just went for hits off rip. I think this guy has to come in. So we're going to see him cross right here. He's fast, man. Look at him go. He's got it, dude. That's going to be the guy that I run up against at the end of the game. 100%. I didn't mean to mark that. Can I not unmark it? Never mind. Okay. Got cold blooded right there. Another stun. So that'll put us back up. And again, I held on to this munitions because I knew... What? What? He broke my armor that fast? Enemy UAV active. This guy's lucky that I literally can't see that far. Which makes me confused as to how he can see that far. He's breaking armor that quick. This is not going to be a fun push. Oh my gosh. I'll get to all the members and super chats after this game, okay? How can this guy see me if my game doesn't even load him? You know what I mean? It makes zero sense. So my goal here... Oh, okay. He keeps hitting his shots. This is what I'm saying. So what I was talking about earlier is how you're making this rotation around the edge. No, stop shooting at me, you a -hole. You've got a guy right beside you. What is that, man? Are you serious? And again, my big thing is I'd really, 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 really like to get restock. I got just bought a UAV. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm. That's exactly what I'm talking about, though. Is that like there's not really any play that you have whenever there's so many people that can see you from so many angles. What I'm trying to do right now is I'm trying to get any position that'll hold cover. So like right here. What is that?
Like, he's just got my number, and he doesn't want to let go of it, dude. Oh, sugar, dude. Okay, we got plates right there. So I grabbed a PDS. Oh, nice. And the reason I grabbed the PDS is because I don't need the Muni any, anymore. But I might need to toss a PDS in the storm and frickity frack. What is this, dude? Is this guy cheating straight up? Like, what's going on? I'm like getting caught in the weirdest spots, man. Okay, nice. We're going up top. The reason I'm choosing to do so is because I'm trying to get more plates because I keep getting caught with zero plates. So there's four players left. I have 20 eliminations right now and I'm kind of holding the edge. The reason that I chose to like run back in the storm is because I knew that I had the gas mask and it could give me a second to plate. And so knowing that that guy was up there, it was just like the smartest play that I could make. This is going to come to the other side. Yeah. Safe zone relocated. So I'm going to do is a full rotation. I'm choosing the full rotation because I'm trying to not make any noise near other players. I'm going to have to push in. Yes, it's right on your tail. But I'm hoping that I can find a good position to hold. Enemy UAV active. We got lucky with plates. That guy's going to push in. It's a 1v1 situation. If he has daddy, he wins. Because what I'm trying to do is I'm thinking about whether or not I need to go right or left. Left is sh technically should be directly into him. But I'm going to check this right side. I don't see him. We're going to rotate back left. There's no... Okay. There's no explosives. Give me my throwing knife. So I still have two stuns. You got gas inbound. Safe zone relocated. Enemy precision airstrike. Stay alert. Gas is inbound. Let's go! That's how you freaking get a win, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully I helped a lot while we were doing that, but good lord, that is that is that is crazy right there. You know what I'm saying? You picking up what I'm putting down. Good gravy, baby. That is how we freaking do it. Oh my goodness.